for the United States champion, the WWE champion, will be taking on Ciampa in a match to try and take away Stripey from Mr. Ciampa, who has had a record-breaking title reign with it, holding it for a unprecedented amount of time, never before seen. Will it all come to an end tonight, though? In the last man standing match against Dylan Legacy, our WWE Champion. In a Legacy match, you can only expect that he will bring absolutely everything in his arsenal, especially when a championship is on the line. Not only that, but they seem to have quite quite the notable amount of bad blood between each other. Dylan Legacy not wasting any time in getting out the chair to hit over the head of Chamaso Champa, who has has a notable history of neck injuries as well. Followed by a big boot. It looks like Dylan Legacy is definitely looking to hurt the uh, the champion Tommaso Champa. Followed by a hip toss after a couple of strikes. Dylan Legacy seems to have the upper hand on the champion right now. Followed by chair shots. Over. Repeated and repeated chair shots by the by the WWE champion to the United States champion. Tommaso Ciampa is getting absolutely demolished right now. We're going to have to see what he can do to come back. Looks like we got a reversal by the challenger. What is he going to do here? Big boot to the face. Holding nothing back as he waits for the ch champion to get up. He knows that the champion, Tommaso Ciampa, can take more than that. And now he's waiting. Waiting for the champion to get up just so he can hit him over the head with a chair. Oh my God. holding it absolutely nothing back it would appear it looks like he's grabbing the still steps it looks like he's looking to absolutely decimate oh my goodness he almost hit the ref throwing the steel steps onto uh, the champion Tommaso Ciampa 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 I'm sorry Oop. A counter. Oh, <gasps> no. No, not on the outside. We know about his neck injury. Oh, my God. Dylan Legacy still targeting the actual hurt neck. The long documented injured neck of Tommaso Ciampa. He is, seems to be going after at every chance he gets. He's waiting for his prey to get up. Like a vicious lion. Hunting its prey. Waiting for it to challenge it. Seems like uh, Champa has enough wherewithal to counter the, uh, the strike that was incoming. Dylan Legacy. Knocks him off. <gasps> Legacy knee! Legacy knee! Legacy knee! Out of nowhere. He's throwing him around the ring like a rag doll now. It seems like Dylan Legacy has come prepared and Champa has not been able to get any momentum in this match. Oh my god. Look at him. Just smashing him over the face with the steel chaps. Oh my goodness. What can the champion do right now? <gasps> Another legacy knee. Another legacy knee by Dylan Legacy. That's right. Dylan Legacy is saying it's the end. That the match is over. Will the champion be able to get up?
Let's find out. Seems like Dylan Legacy does not believe he will. That's right. And your new champion, the new United States champion, dethroning the record, holding Tommaso Ciampa, taking away the precious stripey from Tommaso Ciampa. Give me my damn belt, Ciampa. I just dominated you in that match. That's right. That's right. And your new United States champion, the current WWE champion, Dylan Legacy. <gasps> Ciampa attacking from behind, sending Dylan Legacy careening to the floor outside. Ciampa. Ciampa has lost the attacking Dylan Legacy for no reason. Champa. Champa, what are you doing? Champa. Seemingly a fairy tale ending on the steel stairs. Champa. Champa could not take the loss of Stripey. After being absolutely dominated in the championship match, Champa had to resort to attacking Dylan Legacy after the bell with a cheap shot, possibly injuring him. After the post-match attack by Raw Champa, we've learned that Deptune has de suffered three broken ribs and will be out of action for up to six weeks. We'll have further updates as they become available. You were right. Someone did get hurt. Stripey says hi. Due to the injury to Dylan Legacy, I'm reversing the outcome of the United States Championship match and returning the U.S. title to Champa. Mandy Rose seemingly has not forgiven Dylan Legacy for the hacked text that Drew McIntyre had did done a couple of months ago or about mm, about exactly a month ago now ruining their relationship and now ruining the United States championship that Dylan Legacy rightfully won oh my god seems uh Miss Mandy Rose has seemingly screwed him over once more not being able to forgive him for the uh, unfair text. Ma Miss Rose. Your post. You're stripping me of the title I just won? Uh, what? You gotta explain this. Yeah, Please. I just saw your x-rays and you're going to be out for over a month. What? Which is a month without the U.S. championship being defended on Raw. I have no other choice. Are you kidding me? You never Miss Rose. Me to beat all you care about is keeping his record-breaking reign going for the brand and ratings. Are you serious? That's my job to care about that stuff. Besides, we wouldn't be having this conversation if you weren't soft. <laughs> That's what you called Champa, right? Are you kidding me, Miss Rose? Are you kidding me? You know, the match where I beat him. Not only beat him, where I dominated him. You can go to the performance center, rehab your injury, then come back at full strength. And you'll most likely have a rematch waiting for you. What do you mean, most likely? Most likely? A lot can happen in six weeks. The alternative is you face Ciampa for the championship next week while gasping for air with a chest full of broken ribs, most likely lose, and then maybe never get a shot again. But either way, the title's returning to someone who can defend it immediately at 100%. So what do you want to do? I don't care what you, Champa, or anyone else says about being soft. I'm not going to risk my career for one match. I'll be back for my U.S. title when I'm 100. All right. I'm I'll I'm gonna remember this, Miss Rose. When my when my career, my contract comes up for renewal, 
and I have to decide between staying here or maybe going to a raw or excuse me having to decide between staying on raw or going to smackdown or nxt i'm gonna i'm gonna remember this Just shut up chase we got a match between dylan legacy and injured dylan legacy and chase uh the rib guy Dylan Legacy is putting an absolute beatdown on the chase despite the broken ribs he is suffering from right now. He's calling him up for it. He's calling him up for it. <gasps> Legacy! Knee! Bang! He's pinning Chase. I don't know if he was able to get full power behind that Legacy knee with the injury he's suffering. Seemingly putting away Chase. With relative ease, even though he did suffer from the injury, he was not able to beat him as dominantly as he normally would. We all know this. Dylan Legacy gives us an update. He's back at the PC where it all started. Ribs already feeling better. will be back stronger than ever to reclaim what's his. Champa giving an update. Still greatest U.S. champion in history. Greater than Austin, Piper, Cena, and definitely Deptune, who held Stripey for less than an hour. Who's your daddy? Uh, Road Dog messaging us, Dylan Legacy, uh, watching you train with Chase got me feeling nostalgic about your time here at the PC, so for your next match you're going to be stepping into the ring with the D.O. Double J. Me. Better bring it because I won't be taking it easy on you. Are you kidding me? Road Dog, really? Road Dog and Ribby are my... Come on guys, please. It looks like Dylan Legacy is uh, training while rehabbing right now in a match against R the D.O. Double G Road Dog in the performance center here rehabilitating these uh, broken ribs that he suffered once again by the hands of Tommaso Ciampa after dominating him in the US title match that he rightfully won and became the new US champion However, Mandy Rose has seemingly promised that he will be able to face Champa the moment he gets back. We will see, though. We do know that she uh, does have a history with Mr. Legacy. And uh, is holding a grudge against him for something he is not responsible for. One. Due to the hacking that Drew McIntyre was responsible for. Look at this. Dylan Legacy. Absolutely vicious against Road Dog, Holding nothing back, it would, it would appear. Getting back into form. Powerbomb. Into a knee. Into a knee. He's seemingly holding nothing back as he shows a more brutal side of himself. Not a more brutal side. May I say a more... A less restricted side not caring about the count right now it seems he simply wants to hurt the do double g for even thinking to challenge him in this state of health that he's in a legacy knee on the outside will the do double g be able to get up excuse me sorry had a pause Dylan Legacy wins by count out, knocking Do Double G out on the outside of the ring in the performance center. Dylan Legacy is giving us another update, putting in the work and almost 100% back soon to take back the US Championship that he never lost. Might be good to see your progress firsthand. Maybe Stripey and I will take a trip. What does that mean? All right, well, if you guys liked the, uh, the episode, make sure to leave a like, a comment, subscribe, and share it with your friends, you know? It really helps me uh, with getting my name out there as a content creator, because obviously right now, I'm kind of unknown, but, uh. You know, small steps at a time.
right now we're just getting nice and consistent. So, anyway, I'll see you guys next time on the next session. Bye!